Hey guys, Thunder E here. This is a different review video uh, in terms of how I'm shooting it. I'm using the Microsoft Lumia 950, but I want to talk about something that is really important for me since I live in the Northeast. It's all about heating. So that guy up there, that is my HVAC system. And um, I'm talking about this guy here, the Ecobee uh, 3. This is what I consider one of my top buys from a holiday gift, gift guide. I put it up, I didn't have a review for you, but I do have a review for you now. What I like about this thing is that with the Ecobee 3 here, uh, it comes with separate sensors. So that little thing there allows you to put it in different locations in your house. Now I have a one bedroom apartment, but it still works well because my bedroom is much colder. Anyway, but you get the idea. The idea is to keep myself warm uh, throughout the, you know, the holiday period. And let's go ahead and check it out. So I'm gonna walk backwards with the camera um, and I'll show you some of the stuff that this actually does. So let's go over to our Ecobee right here. So this, this is the Ecobee right here. The one thing you should note is that you need to know what kind of system you have. Like with any of this um, uh, Wi-Fi app enabled thermostats, you still need to know what kind of system you have. So as I mentioned, I have a HVAC here. So what that means is I have a system that uses a furnace and that's really important. But one thing I like about the Ecobee off the bat is when you look at it here, it's off. It tells me the temperature. I can tap on that and I can see the weather outside. It gives me also current weather throughout the day as well as, you know, some forecasting for me. So I can actually use this on my way out the door and I can use that, which is pretty cool. Now to turn this on, this is where um, I wish they need to, need, need to do a little improvements here. So there is no clear way for me to turn on immediately because of I have a HVAC, I have to go there. So I have to go to system. I didn't have to turn on heat. Then I have to put whatever I want the fan. Now I do like that customization there, but what that means is also that you have to do a lot more in terms of turning it on. So I can set whichever I want. So I can say 15 minutes. I can either do heat, cold, or auto. Now with the HVAC system, auto just doesn't work well, um, just because of my system itself. And then I go here, then I can increase and slide my temperature to wherever uh, I choose to. Now, as you saw here, the main menu has a lot of options. The one thing to note is that all this is accessible on your mobile app, and we'll showcase that once we look at the app quickly. But you have your sensors. So you can see I have different sensors. I have the Ecobee, which is this. I have a small sensor in my bedroom. Uh, I have uh, s smart options, which I can enable or disable. I always have it disabled. I have a schedule, which I can set for temperature and you can hear it kick in. You've also got comfort settings. You can set for home away, things like that. You've got a vacation uh, scheduler if you want to, reminders, system alerts. And of course, this is connected to your wireless network at home. And you have the about system. now. Again, this thing is really simple and easy. And of course, I can literally pull this off the wall boom, and show you the connections. Now, if you don't know how to connect this, you know, there are many videos out there on, on the web. I'm not even going to show you that, but there are many videos to set this up. Uh, they also have a nice setup process and also use your customer service line. If it's still, still not comfortable with that, you can always call an electrician. But this is how the unit is and looks very simple. I'm going to just put it back again turn it back on, it will actually go through its whole booter process. Now, while it's doing that, let us go ahead and take a look at the uh, app itself. Now you're wondering, what is this? This is not a button here, this is actually the sensor uh, for taking temperature and things like that. So let's take a look at the application on the on our Android uh, smartphone. All right, so onto our mobile app here, and you can see that uh, it looks exactly like the Ecobee. This is temperature. I can go ahead and check out the weather outside and bring back that down. I have this quick option here for quick changes, fan auto on and off uh, for the uh, HVAC. So I'm going to put it on or auto I can switch that off. Um, and then we still have those save options. So you can go through all the different options here. We can um, even add a thermostat to it too. So we can add a, another Ecobee onto um, this, which is actually pretty good. Um, you know, it gives you full flexibility. The cool thing about this is that while I'm on the road or if I'm out, I can come back home and actually control my uh, system. And actually, I'll do it from here. So just to show you, I'm going to go off Wi-Fi. 
and uh, I'm going to actually go ahead and turn my system on, go to heat. So at least you hear the fan kick in. Then bring that up. The one thing I'll say that the app can be a little fidgety, a little bit, but not that much. I'm gonna put it at 10 minutes. And then uh, I have to go back out, go out here main again, and I can increase my temperature. So let's increase this thing quickly. Let's take it all the way up to 78. You're gonna hear my, my HVAC kick in pretty soon. So now when it says 78 and holding, it means that that's the temperature it's gonna to get to and hold that temperature, which means it will constantly come on to make sure that it stays at 78 degrees. Now, if I X that out, then it will actually revert back to my old uh, setup. So just waiting, let's see if we can crank this a little higher. Um, I guess it is pretty warm right now in the apartment, but that's the whole idea of what this does. Now, uh, while we wait for that, this is the little sensor I told you. So this is the other sensor where you can actually pick the sensor up and use this around the house. So you can buy, um, so it comes with one. You can also add multiple sensors to different locations in the house. If you have a house that only has one thermostat or an apartment that has one thermostat, this actually works well. Um, if you have multiple thermostats that are needed in an apartment, you can still add multiple units of the Ecobee around and actually set that up uh, for whatever room location that may be. Uh, let's turn that down. So, I mean, I do like it. I like the fact that I can um, keep my apartment warm. I like, I like its functionality. It works really, really well. The Ecobee uh, does a fantastic job there. I think a lot of people will like its functionality, its form, uh, what you get with this uh, in terms of just pure performance. So I think, you know, this goes a long way in, just in terms of performance altogether. So yeah, that is the Ecobee 3. That's what I use to keep myself warm. Um, I absolutely love the thing. Uh, again, the one thing I do not like is my HVAC. It, it has nothing to do with the Ecobee itself. Uh, but I will say though that it is absolutely fantastic. It's great that I can set schedules, especially if I know maybe that week I'm gonna be going out of the house more or less. I can set my schedules for that. I can turn it on anywhere I am, anywhere around the world, I can actually activate and use my thermostat in my house. Um, I do like the fact that it also realizes when I'm away, um, especially with the follow me function uh, on there. So that's actually pretty cool. It does a really good job. Uh, so hopefully you guys like it. Uh, and let me know what you think about this video recording using the Microsoft Lumia um, uh, 950. I use the front facing camera and the rear camera combined to do this video. So. Uh, so hopefully you guys enjoy that. If you have any questions, any comments about the Ecobee 3, let me know. If you want to pick one up, we'll have an Amazon link for you down below. Or use our Amazon link, uh, our Amazon store link to actually purchase one. I absolutely recommend it. Doesn't matter what kind of system you have, it will work and it is, it is fantastic. It does a really good job. Uh, and again, it's cold here in, um, you know, in New York, but wear my t-shirt because it's nice and warm in here. So anyway, um, thank you, subscribe to the channel, and always enjoy your entertainment.